Who's ready to fly? Yeah! We are uh, out here in uh, the snow park and um, getting ready to race our snow boats. We had our first four inches of snow. Now it's time to get out here and start racing. So we got mine, I did one more fast. Then we got Sean and Kieran's. Then we got Tyler's and um, Tyler's. And then we got some uh, refabricated one from last year. Yeah. All ready to rock and roll. Okay, the object is just to do circles. <laughs> and you gotta do at least three laps. Okay. Okay? Yeah. Someone give us a count. Three, three, two, two one! one. first attempt and it's only you know early November uh, for our first snow race um, looks like you guys got a little bit of competition you're gonna have to uh, create some better boats um, <laughs> okay so obviously what you guys learn from this Sean um, use smart water yeah. bottles smart water bottles or besides smart water bottles what else well um, kind of make it whole and not have it in parts okay and maybe um, the foam board against the snow might not be a good idea, huh? No. Okay, so now that you've seen it in action, now you're going to want to take it back to the drawing board and try to make something that's not so complicated in here. Now that you've seen some of these that are done, maybe we can create some boats that are 
yeah. you know, a little bit easier. Um, and then what did you guys think, Tyler, about yours? Um, it worked until um, yours, like, mowed over ours. And it, <laughs> and it, and it crushed all the smart water bottles. Okay, yeah. so and we need to pressurize them yeah. for uh, coming out here because it's colder. Uh, so the air very is good. Yeah. shrinking, and so they, like, sucked in. And then this top piece caught, and we couldn't. What about, what about cutting the plastic halfway through and actually these bottom pieces act as skis? So you then stick something else inside them instead of it actually having the bottles. Yeah. And that then we work. need a little bit more weight because it's just like flying all over the place. It's way too fast. Good. And, and for tight quarters like this, you know, you're going to have to face against the tank. So if the tank's going to tear you apart, you're going to have to be able to battle that. <laughs> okay. And then um, this one, how was this one, Ashton? We just did this one real fast. Yeah, it was, it was great. Uh, it went kind of crazy when you didn't need it and didn't do anything when you didn't want it to. <laughs> so to. we'll probably... Um, uh, maybe put some rudders or something on the bottom here like we did last time to kind of help it steer. Otherwise, it was great. Cool. That's awesome. Nice. Well, um, if you guys got, you know, with snow in your area and you can't go flying, um, by all means, take, you know, take all those equipment that you guys still have off your plane, throw them on some home boards, and, and come up with some cool snowmobiles. We've done this before, uh, but we have, you know, never come up with four or so snowmobiles at the same time. So, thanks for watching.